who were some of the drummers that grabbed you? Like, we, did you have sort of inspiration or influences? Oh, yeah. Always Brian Blade and Elvin Jones. Those two of them, like my main influences. Also Tony Williams, of course. At one point, I had a pretty big Buddy Rich face. <laughs> oh, really? Um, and yeah, that was cool. The Buddy Rich is interesting because I think your snare work is very dynamic. And um, as, as a lay person, I'm glad I could hear some of that before speaking with you. <laughs> yeah, Buddy Rich fascinated me with his technique, honestly. I'm a left-hander. Left-handed, so I switched. I started like the normal way these days, match grip. But then with my teacher back in the days, I switched to traditional grip and I played it even since then, just because I'm left-handed and it kind of makes sense. But Buddy Rich, I mean, he's the master, of course, in traditional technique or in like all snare drum technique. That's why it fascinated me. 